Hello everybody, Drifter here from Drifter Gaming, and in this special request RPG Maker MV tutorial, I'm going to show you how to make the Initiator TP mode. So Neophyte, uh, this is a special request RPG Maker MV tutorial for Neophyte, and he asks, hey, do you think you can make a TP mode like this, Initiator? It will start each battle with 100% TP, however it cannot gain any TP throughout the battle, and each turn it loses 20 TP too. I figured this would be really good for trash mobs too, but terrible against bosses because of the inability to learn to earn TP throughout making them unable to use their special attacks. So let me show you how to do that. Go into your plugin manager. If you um, are unsure how to add this, I'll put a link in the description below, below uh, where you can download this plugin from Yanfly. Um, just put it into your JS plugins folder. And then uh, in your plugin manager, you can put it into uh, your plugin manager right here towards the middle of Yanfly scripts. Um, once you've got your plugin added, we're going to go to an empty mode to where you see that says undefined. If, you do, if you've already been making modes and you're out of modes, Yanfly has released uh, expansion plugins for the enhanced TP, so you can have up to 100 modes now. So um, just add the yep underscore x underscore more TP modes one two three four underneath enhanced TP and uh, make sure you put them in that order um, and once you've done that you go to an undeclared one and double click it and rename it the initiator give it whatever icon you like uh, for the helpline one we're gonna say gain full TP at the start of combat for helpline two we're gonna say preserve TP and TP regen are disabled now I know you asked for uh, the ability to make it so that every round you lose 20 TP and I was unable to do that so what I'm thinking is it's either bad code that I put in or there's a clamp or a condition that you can't have negative regen for your uh, your uh, TP regen so instead we've set the TP regen to zero so that uh, you can't gain TP with regen or, or and you won't be preserving it but uh, I can't uh, figure that out so if you figure it out let me know I'd like to figure that out too uh, what we're going to do for the max TP, uh, actually I've done this for all of my modes. Uh, before I had this as uh, this right here, 90 plus user dot level times 10, so that every time you uh, level up you'll get uh, 10 more max TP. And uh, by level uh, 99 you'll have uh, a thousand and, uh, what is it, a thousand and eighty. Um, but I've met, if you've made this so that you're going to have uh, past level 99, like in this game will be max level 999, it might be unrealistic to have more than 1,000 TP. So what we're doing for max TP now is we're taking the same thing, but we're going to enclose this into another set of parentheses, and we're going to use dot clamp, open parentheses 100, comma 1,000. So what this is going to do, it's going to make it so that your TP can never go under 100 or over 1,000. So even if you have level 272, you're still going to be max 1,000 uh, TP with this setup. So once you've got that, 90 uh, open parentheses, 90 plus parentheses, user dot level times 10, close parentheses, close parentheses again, dot clamp, parentheses 100 comma 1,000, close parentheses, we'll move on down. We're going to disable the um, preserve TP, so at the end of combat, um, they'll be back to zero TP. So we're going to go in here and change the true to false. We're going to set our initial TP to 1,000. Since we've set our max to 1,000, we know that they're never going to have over 1,000, so we can just put 1,000 in here. And that's going to do it. That's all there is to it for uh, the initiator uh, TP mode. So let's take a look at the mode in combat real quick. Of course, this is just a template for you to use to change to to make it however you want. So we can see that we have zero TP, in my case it's LP, but if we start a combat, um, we're, we're at full TP. So we have our full TP there. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching. Remember to like, favorite, share, and subscribe if you did like this content. It helps the channel grow and lets me know you're interested in this sort of content. So thank you guys so much. If you have a special request, put it in the comments below, and we will see you in the next tutorial.